I'm gonna share one of my favorite tuna salads and also my newest favorite tuna that I'm getting. Rather than using mayonnaise, it uses mashed avocado. So it's so good and great for people who don't like mayonnaise. And I love this lunch because I can have it ready in like five minutes. So it's perfect for those days that I didn't prep anything, but I need something good and fast. <laughs> I've got Ryan here. Do you want to help out? You want to show the tuna? Okay, this is my new favorite tuna. It comes in pouches. I get it at Costco. I love it so much. Here, let me put it back. Okay, this is a little easier. This is my favorite tuna I've been getting lately at Costco. This isn't sponsored, it's just my favorite one. They test every batch for mercury. It is officially Whole30 approved. The only ingredients are just tuna and water, or no, tuna and salt. It comes in pouches and it's just three ounce pouches. So it's the perfect amount for one person. A normal can has five ounces and it's always just a little too much and I feel bad wasting it. You don't even need a can opener. You just rip it open, it's so easy. Here it is straight out of the packet. And you can see it's not, there's a little bit of water, like that much. But I kind of like it, it keeps it juicy. And you can see that compared to my hand, it's the perfect amount for just one person. This avocado, it's one of those Costco ones. It's pretty big. It's like the size of my hand. So I'm just gonna use half. My favorite combo is, so I've added the tuna and the avocado together, and today I'm doing it with a tomato from my garden, some parsley and some celery, and then fresh pepper. I don't add salt, because I think the tuna has enough. You could also use whatever veggies you have on hand. I've used radishes, cucumber, bell peppers, chopped up, little carrots, and it's good with other herbs too. You could do dill, cilantro, really good. So the last thing I always add is some lemon juice. For brightness so we'll squeeze in the juice from half a lemon and then mash this up now it's all mashed up and it is so good mayonnaise free so if you are like me and you're by yourself right now and the kids are napping you can eat it just like this or you can get fancy and eat it like this you can put the tuna back in the avocado skin and it's its own little dish <laughs> Like if you're having your girlfriends over, you could like make them a salad and then put this on top and they're gonna think you are so fancy. <laughs> this is seriously so good, I promise. I cannot wait to dig into this. <laughs>